is a, again, transvenous catheter, and this is the balloon on the end of it. And I've got a video I'm going to show you in just a little bit that, that shows me inflating the balloon. But similar as a pulmonary artery catheter, um, if you consider the tip would be the zero mark, you could see the next mark then is two dashes. That would be 20 centimeters, three dashes, 30 centimeters four dashes, 40 centimeters, one big dash is 50, a big and a little is 60, etc. And this is sitting in the right ventricle, so it's not going in as far as a pulmonary artery catheter. So for example, the exit number from a pulmonary artery catheter in a lot of adults, if it's a small adult, might be like 55, 56 to 60 centimeters. If they're tall, it might be like upwards of 65, whereas we're only going into the right ventricle. So it depends on how tall the person is or how big their heart is. Uh, but most people, you're seeing like 35, 40-ish. Um, if they're tall, it might be in a little further, it might be like 45-ish or so. Uh, but it's, it's always helpful to know what normal is is to understand like if I've got a, a, a catheter that's in at like the 60 centimeter mark, uh, that, that's in pretty far. And I'm wondering, is it coiling in the right ventricle? Have we perforated the right ventricle? Is the patient going in a tamponade? Do they have hiccups, etc. And I'll talk about a lot of the complications of transvenous pacing in just a little bit.